Hey everybody, how are y'all doing today? It is Friday. I am so excited. It is finally the weekend and I hope you guys have a lovely weekend. Um, Monday is a holiday. It's Labor Day. So I hope that you guys are going to have a great long three day weekend and I'm just going to be doing a quick video today of um, my Walmart grocery haul. I just want to come on here and show you guys what I picked up in case there's anything that you may be interested in. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and get started. I have, um, this is just real laid back today, y'all. I'm not, um, I'm not really going to any trouble to lay things out for y'all, but, um, sorry about that. I was just trying to hurry up and put these groceries away. So, um, I picked up, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six cans of this chicken and rice. It's the Great Value brand. These are 50 cents a can, and I love these. I buy these all the time. Um, they're really inexpensive, but they're really good. And then I bought this Homestyle Chicken Noodle. Um, these are hard to find. They only had one in the store yesterday. These are 50 cents as well. Um, they are hard to find, so I'll probably have to go back another day and maybe they'll restock and I can get some more. But this is my favorite chicken noodle soup. It has vegetables in it. it um, very few though. It's mostly just, um, there's a lot of broth and, uh, noodles. The noodles are very thin. So if you're not a big fan of noodles, you may actually like this. Um, and then I picked up, let's see, one, two cans of the tomato soup. Actually, I pulled these out um, to show you guys, but these didn't come from Walmart. I got those from somewhere else. I just pulled them out by mistake. Um, and then I bought these cans. I bought two cans of the Del Monte Fiesta corn. This is seasoned red season with red and green peppers and i bought this to make a dip i'm going to be making a corn dip and i will be um uploading that video soon so um i bought the fiesta corn for the dip and then two cans of rotel i got one chunky and one original just to kind of mix it up and then um i saw these i have not tried these before but i saw that it's got a recipe on the back for chicken nacho tacos and um i thought this would be good so I'm just gonna try it these were $1.48 each the corn was $1.48 each the Rotel was 98 cents each and then back here I've got this big bottle of ranch um, and it was around two dollars and fifty cents I picked up two of the honey bunches of oats I already opened up one um, earlier um, maple pecan and maple brown sugar I love that and then I got the um, honey roasted so this is a really great cereal to eat if you're watching your calories it has three-fourths of a cup with milk is 160 calories and 25 carbs um and i like to add cinnamon to mine and that just gives it a really great flavor uh i picked up the reese's cups the white reese's cups and my children love these they were a dollar 99 no i'm sorry dollar 98 for this pack um and you usually can only find these around halloween time um <clears throat> i picked up two of these old old el paso nacho cheese flavored um taco kits and we usually eat tacos about once a week so i like to have these on hand and they were two for five and then i picked up some tuna fish this is my favorite tuna fish this is the star kissed chunk white albacore tuna and these were 4.58 for four cans i love that tuna fish it is so good and then i picked up two of these betty crocker fudge mixes brownie mixes um my kids love brownies especially my son so i'll probably make those for him this weekend and then they had these snapples on sale the um kiwi strawberry is our favorite and these uh, there's six bottles in here, um, 16 ounces in each bottle. It's only 190 calories. Oh, only 190 calories. That's a lot. Um, but I'm just saying like for the kids, I guess that's better than soda or, you know, even Gatorade sometimes. But this is not something they would drink all the time. But anyways, uh, they had these on sale. The six pack was $3.98. Um... I picked up this uh, original Greek strawberry yogurt. I love this yogurt. I get it all the time. I love the vanilla. I love the um, strawberry cheesecake. And Walmart usually has the best deal. If I go to Kroger and you buy one, they're usually a dollar. So you can get this four pack 
for $2.98 at Walmart. Um, there's only 80 calories, 12 grams of protein, and let's see, only eight carbs. So that's great. I love to make um, parfait yogurts. Um, also, I buy the raspberry as, uh, flavor as well. And I just um, will either take usually the raspberry or the vanilla and just put it in a cup and put some fresh fruit on top and some granola. Um, <clears throat> so that is really good. Um, I'll show you right quick while I'm talking about that. This granola that I have been picking up at Aldi, and it is so good. Um, there's two kinds, actually. So these are a special at Aldi right now. I'm not sure this is going to be something. You know how they'll just bring items out just to kind of see how they sell. So I'm not sure if they're going to have this all the time. But they do have some that they have regularly. Um, but this is the Simply Nature Organic. This is Ancient um, Grains and Granola. And then this one says Vanilla Almond Flax Granola. Now this one is my absolute favorite. These were around $2 a bag. You can take this out and put it in a bowl with milk and have it as cereal, or you can sprinkle it like on your parfait, or there's, um, you know, different ways that you can, you can use that. Um, so, okay, moving right along. Right here, I've got this organic mint plant. Um, I bought this to have to use in hot tea. I love to make Ethiopian hot tea. Um, you don't have to have special tea bags if you've got Lipton tea on hand it's just the style because you know Ethiopia is very um, famous for their teas and coffees um, my children are half half Ethiopian so um, I do know some Ethiopian res uh, recipes um, I love going to Ethiopian restaurants if you guys are interested in getting some recipes for me let me know give, give me a thumbs up leave me a comment down below um, but anyways this plant was um i think it was 2.98 it was either 2.98 or 3.98 um i have bought one before in the past and i did plant it outside and it grew like wildfire um and in fact even after the winter it the following year grew back again and um anyways i just wanted to buy a new one to go in the house and i'm going to just take these leaves and wash and clean them and put them in a ziploc bag and put them in the fridge and i'm going to be making hot tea so if you're interested in that i will be um doing a video of that coming up soon i picked up some clairol hair color some toothpaste i got the colgate total whitening and then the crest 3d whitening those are our two favorite toothpaste and then i picked up the gallon of the vegetable oil it's 4.98 and i bought this sour cream this is also for the corn dip that i'm going to be making and then i found these in the produce it says market side crinkle cut sweet potatoes they were um a dollar 52 on clearance they were regular um around three dollars and it said that they went out of date today but they're fine as long as i stick them in the freezer but i'm sure i'll be using them soon so it just says to roast them in the oven it says that you can fry them but i'm not going to do that i'm going to roast them in the oven so basically you just get you out like a cookie sheet um put you some olive oil on there and sprinkle these with salt and pepper and bake them let's see it says to bake them 15 to 20 minutes at 450 degrees okay um i got some buttermilk waffles for my daughter and then I got the blueberry waffles. I love those. I got the Texas toast garlic bread. I bought this big box of chips because my children take them every day in their lunch. So there's all kinds of varieties. There's 32 bags total. And the box was $10. Um, I'm trying to watch the oven over here, guys. I have something in the oven. I want to make sure it doesn't burn. Uh, they had Lunchables on sale for a dollar. So um, I bought 10 of those. There's my beeper. Hold on one second. Um, I bought 10 Lunchables. My kids take Lunchables every day to school, and they're normally $1.78, so whenever they run them on sale for a dollar, I like to get a lot of them. Um, I would have gotten more, but they actually had them on sale last week at Kroger as well, so I already had a lot in the fridge, but I went ahead and picked up 10 more just in case. Okay, I got these, um, 
flour tortillas this is mission brand it says carb balance there's only six carbs i didn't realize how many carbs and until lately how many carbs and calories are in tortillas so i had stopped buying them but my daughter does like them whenever we have taco night she likes to have like one crunchy taco and one soft taco so i went ahead and bought them but this one has 120 calories and 19 grams for one um, piece. So if you're only gonna have one, that's not bad. Okay, I picked up the Great Value brand Flaky Jumbo Biscuits. There's eight in there and they were $1.50. And then I got these cinnamon rolls. My kids like to have these like on the weekend, um, like on Sunday if we're going to church and we don't have time to cook a big breakfast. Um, so they like to have those on hand and those were $1.50. And then also I picked up these Gogurts my son loves them i love them as well if you put them in the freezer that's what we do you can open up this pouch and stick these stick the whole pack in the freezer uh and freeze them and eat them like a popsicle and they're cute for the kids they've got um they've got different uh jokes on there but anyways there's um eight strawberry flavor and then eight berry flavor they have all different flavors guys you can look and see they have cotton candy they have all kinds but um basically what they're saying is that if you put these in the freezer and then um in the morning when you are packing your children's lunch that hopefully they should be thawed by lunchtime but my kids don't like to take them to lunch because they don't like to eat them thawed they prefer them to be frozen so i just leave them in the freezer and this was 458 for this pack that you can if you just want to try some out if you haven't tried them before they do have a smaller pack you can buy the eight pack the eight count pack there's only 50 calories and eight grams of sugar in each one so they're not that bad um has vitamin a and d and then yogurt in it okay so I think that is it, guys. I'm going to get off of here. I hope that you guys have a lovely weekend. Thank you so much for tuning in. If this is your first time to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that um, you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And I will be talking to you guys soon. And what else did I want to tell you guys? Oh, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button down below. Bye, guys.